Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to create a Windows 10 bootable USB drive. First of all, all you need is a pen drive of minimum 8 GB size, Windows 10 ISO file, and a Rufus software. So Rufus software can be downloaded from the Rufus official website, rufus.ie. I'll paste the same link in the description as well. So scroll down and you will be able to see a Rufus of so and so version. Click on that. It will download. It is a very so small software which can be directly executed. I'm double clicking it. I am connecting the pen drive to my laptop. So my pen drive is a 16 GB. So I'm I'm using uh, more than 8 GB because the Windows 10 image itself will take 4 GB. If you use 4 GB, there might be a possibility like uh, it couldn't load the complete ISO image in that pen drive. So which I have, I have is 16 GB. So as I connected only pen drive, it is showing up only one thing here. If you have two USB drives connected. It will show up. Select the one which you want, and uh, you can you should select the ISO image, disk or ISO image, and you should be you should be pointing to the Windows 10 ISO image in your laptop wherever you have downloaded. So if you I already have downloaded the Windows 10. If you don't have that, you can download from the Windows website for free. I'm just pointing to that Windows 10 image whichever I have downloaded. And click open, and it scans that image, and it shows a ready status. Yeah, it is ready now. So there is one more thing called partition screen here. There is a MBR and GPT. So which one you should be selecting? That we can find out by using. Uh, the disk management. So go to that pen, go to the laptop where you are to install the Windows 10. There you go to disk disk management that you can see you will see the create 10 format disk partition. Go to that and you will you want to be installing the operating system here. You can see a GPT here. So you should be selecting GPT as the partition screen. If it is showing a MBR here, you should be choosing MBR. I have chosen the GPT and the volume label, we can give it as anything. I'm leaving it as is and click on start. It will show up a warning like the entire content in this pen drive will be removed. So make sure if you have something in that pen drive, you back up it before doing this bootable thing. I'm clicking in OK. Yeah, it says creating file system. Yeah, it will be writing all the content to the pen drive. Once this is done, the bootable pen drive will be ready to use. So that's it, guys. After this is ready, you can use the pen drive as a bootable disk. That's it, guys. Thank you for watching.